guys and welcome back to my channel it's your girl Nisha and today we're back with another video so for today's video we will be doing a Kylie Cosmetics haul so I decided to do a little shopping on the Kylie Cosmetics website and decided to purchase some new liquid lipsticks so I did notice they did come out with some new of their lip blushes so I definitely had to go and give that a try so that is what we are going to unbox today so I have this entire box filled with a lot of Kylie goodies so we're gonna go ahead and unbox these and see what we got in my haul and we're also gonna be swatching these as well thinking what we think seeing how the colors look on my lips as well so I'm super excited to give these a try if you guys love seeing videos like this please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below turn on your post notifications give this video a thumbs up and let's get right into our Kylie Cosmetics haul so in this box we do have a lot of goodies so let's go ahead and see what's in here so when I open it up first I know Notice these cute stickers so we have some Kylie Cosmetics stickers this would be cute to decorate some of my planners with so love that next I do notice a sample so this is their Kylie skin eye cream so I'm kind of intrigued to try their eye cream because I haven't really tried any of their skincare products just because I'm really cool with the products that I'm using for my skin I'm kind of scared to try products from other brands that weren't really skincare brands to begin with but I'm excited to give this a try and see how this works so in here I purchased one matte liquid lipsticks and I purchased four of the lip kits so let's go ahead and see what we have so I purchased one of the liquid lipstick and lip liner lip kits and this was the collaboration with Stassi yeah I believe it was with Stassi then I purchased two of the lip blushes and then I purchased one of her matte lip kits as well so I'm really excited to see what these lip blushes are about because these are supposed to be very comfortable they're supposed to be kind of like a good wash of color they're supposed to have a lightweight texture and it's supposed to look kind of like a blotted finish so I feel like these these are supposed to be kind of like a dupe or impersonation of some of the K-Beauty brands where they kind of have like that blotted look on their lips. So I'm excited to see how these shades look on me and to try the formulation as well because they're supposed to be a lot more lighter in consistency than the matte lip kits. So for the lip blushes, I picked up two colors. I picked up Booked and Busy and I picked up Sister Sister. And this shade looked like the perfect everyday shade. Let's go ahead and swatch these. So of course, Sister Sister is going to be more of like your everyday kind of like movie brown sort of shade. So inside these lip kits includes the liquid lipstick and the matching lip liner. And of course, packaging basically looks like the standard Kylie Cosmetics packaging as well as their liquid lipsticks. Although the Kylie is now at the bottom, which is really nice and it's more of like a frosted glass bottle, but still is pretty cute and it definitely gives off the Kylie aesthetic of the brand. And when you swatch the shades, this is what it does look like. So this is the liner Sister Sister and then this is the liquid Liquid lipstick and the liquid lipstick did apply a little bit more lighter and moussier than the typical matte liquid lipsticks so let's go ahead and apply these onto my lips so on my lips I just have my lip balm on I have no lip liner or nothing these are just my natural lips so I'm just gonna go ahead and line it with the lip liner first Okay, so honestly, lining it with the lip liner Sister Sister, I honestly didn't see a difference when I applied it to my lip. I felt like it was kind of like my lips but better. So I'm just gonna go ahead and apply the liquid lipstick. So this is what the liquid lipstick does look like or should I say the lip blush looks like I actually really like it it kind of looks like it actually does look like my lips but better and I actually really like it. it looks pretty natural you can still tell that I do have something on my lips but I actually really like it it's kind of like the perfect sort of everyday kind of color so I'm actually pleasantly happy with the color and how it looks on my skin tone in terms of texture it does dry down to sort of like a matte finish but it does feel super lightweight and it literally felt like I wasn't applying anything onto to my lip and it just feels so comfortable like when I'm talking it doesn't feel like tacky or thick or anything like that it just glided on really nice and it kind of has like sort of like a slight moussey consistency to it but overall it feels super lightweight and I absolutely love the texture love the color love the feel on my lips so this was in the shade sister sister So now that I've removed Sister Sister from my lips, I'm gonna go ahead with the shade Book and Busy and give that a try. But like the last lip blush lip kit, it does come with a lip liner and a liquid lipstick. So the one in the middle, this is Booked and Busy. So this is the lip liner and this is the lip blush. So this does look a lot more pinkier from Sister Sister, which kind of looks like your everyday sort of nude. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply the lip liner onto my lips. So we 
have the lip liner applied, now I'm gonna go in with the lip blush. Okay, so this is the lip liner and the lip blush in Booked and Busy. And just like the last lip blush, this applied super well. The texture is really nice. It's really nice and airy. It glided on so smoothly. It feels so comfortable on the lips. And I love that it looks very natural almost, but you still get that really nice saturation of the pink. And I absolutely love it. I'm actually genuinely shocked that I love these so much as I do. I feel like I like these a lot better than her matte lip kits. Honestly saying, like I feel like I love these so much more because they I just feel so comfortable. I can definitely see myself wearing these on a day-to-day -day basis, especially seeing myself wearing Sister Sister a lot more. Like I feel like this is such an everyday go-to lip. I honestly can't wait until she puts a lot more shades of the lip blushes. Like I absolutely love these. The formulation is incredible. It's amazing. I absolutely love it. I honestly give these lip blush lip kits a 10 out of 10 because I absolutely love the color. I love how they feel. They feel so light and airy and they just look so nice on my skin tone. So Kylie, you did an amazing job with these lip blushes. I absolutely love them. So this is in the shade Booked and Busy. Okay, so now that we've removed all the lip blushes from my lips, I'm now gonna go ahead and try on the liquid lip kit in the shade Stassi Baby. So this was her collaboration with Stassi. I think I'm saying her name right, Stassi. Yeah, so this is her collaboration. So I'm super excited to give this a try. Of course, packaging is very Kylie. It is super cute. It is this cute light sky blue and I absolutely love it with the pink writing. Similar to her liquid lipstick, you have a light blue cap and then you have, it says Stassi times Kylie for their collab. And I absolutely love the packaging. It just looks so cute and pretty So I'm just gonna go ahead and swatch these for you guys so you guys can see what the color does look like So this is what saucy baby does look like you kind of have like a movie lip liner And then you kind of have a nice pink liquid lipstick typically when I do wear Kylie liquid lipsticks I absolutely love them. They have great staying power. They stay matte all day I honestly feel like they are very transfer proof because usually when I'm drinking coffee and such the color is still on my lips And there's not much transfer to the actual cup. So I'm really excited to see how this color looks like on my skin tone. So let's go ahead and give it a try. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply the lip liner to my lips. So trying the lip liner, it does look like a really nice pink, like a natural pink on my lips. So now I'm gonna go ahead with the liquid lipstick and apply that right on top of the lip liner. Okay, so after trying the lip blushes, honestly, like applying the liquid lipstick just feels so different. I just absolutely love the consistency of the lip blushes. They were so easy. They're so lightweight to apply and they just hugged your lips so well. So applying the liquid lipstick, it just kind of felt like kind of bland. I don't know how I feel about this color. I feel like it is kind of like a pink that I kind of stay away from. I feel like if I were to use like my MAC lip liner in cork or chestnut, this color will look a lot more nicer on me, but I just feel like it kind of looks a little bit more of like a stark pink that I kind of typically stay away from. It just looks a little bit too bright for my liking. So I would definitely pair this with my MAC Cork Lip Liner just to kind of tone down the pink and kind of give it kind of like an ombre effect so it complements my skin tone a lot better. Honestly, I kind of give the shade a 4 out of 10. The pink looks really nice, but I just wish it came with like a little bit more of like a brown liner just for people who might be a little bit more of like a tan complexion or a little bit more deeper. So this is in the shade Stassi Baby. Okay, so now that we removed Stassi Baby from my lips, I honestly wasn't a fan of that pink by itself. Now we're gonna try the last of our liquid lipsticks. So the last lip kit that I have, this is in the shade Better Not Pout, and it is a matte formulation, and I believe these are one of her like newer shades from like the OG shades she has released previously. So I'm really excited to give it a try. So like the other lip liner, you have the standard Kylie packaging, which is really cute, and it's like a really nice baby pink. And then the liquid lipstick, this one has like kind of like the original original Kylie packaging that she's known to have. So this is really nice and it is a beautiful kind of like a pinky plum purple kind of color. So I'm really intrigued to try this because it is fall and I'm all about my dark colors. So let's go ahead and give this a try. <laughs> so 
so this is what the lip liner does look like on my lips and I completely forgot to swatch this on the back of my hand for you guys so this is what the lip liner and liquid lipstick does look like it is a really nice kind of like a pinkish kind of plum purple sort of color that I absolutely love to wear for the fall so now that we have the lip liner applied let's go ahead and apply the liquid lipstick So I have to say I absolutely love this color so much. I honestly personally would pair this with a little bit more of like a darker lip liner like Matte's Night Moth or Chestnut or Quark. But I absolutely love this color. This is definitely up my alley for all the purple plums that I absolutely love to wear for the fall. So I definitely absolutely love this. So this was the Kylie Cosmetics Lip Kit in the shade Better Not Pout. Okay, so now that we have Better Not Pout wiped off of my lip, now we're gonna try our last liquid lipstick. So this is the liquid lipstick in the shade Clap Back. So again, this is one of her newer shades as well, so I'm really intrigued to see how the color looks on my skin tone. Oh my god, guys, this shade is gorgeous. So it is a pretty nice kind of like a brown nude sort of color. And I only got the liquid lipstick just because I already have my matte chestnut and my matte cork lip liner. So I can easily just use that and pair that with this liquid lipstick. And plus, I tend to go for a darker lip liner because I'm more of like a brown skin girl. So I love to have a darker lip liner to use with my nude liquid lipsticks. I hate when they match because I feel like it just looks so off-putting on my lips. So let's go ahead and swatch this color for you guys. So this is what the color does look like right over here. It is a beautiful kind of like warm brown sort of shade, which is amazing for all year round, including fall. So I'm going to go ahead and line my lips with MAC Cork, and then I'm going to apply this right on top of my lips. Okay, so now that we have Max Cork line on my lips, I'm gonna go ahead and apply this right on top. Oh my gosh, this is literally the perfect shade to match Max Cork. Like, I literally lined my lips with Max Cork and I applied this on top, and I felt like this color matched the liner perfectly, like down to a T. So, I absolutely love that. I absolutely love how it looks on my skin. It absolutely looks so Stunning. I can definitely see myself rocking this shade all year long, especially in the fall, and I absolutely love this. And since this does match and it looks really well, just imagine how this is going to look with Max Chestnut. Oh my goodness, I can just see all the looks I can do with this liquid lipstick. So I'm really happy with this purchase. So this was the Kylie Cosmetics Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade Clap Back. Those are all the Kylie Cosmetics lip blushes and liquid lipsticks that I was able to get from my Kylie haul. I hope you guys really enjoyed that video. Overall, I really loved the lip blushes. They were amazing. Very lightweight, comfortable to wear. They applied so effortlessly. I absolutely love them and they look very natural, but they still look like you had something on your lips and I absolutely love the formulations. The Stassi Baby liquid lip, not a big fan of it. Did not like how that color looked to me at all, but definitely if I use a different lip liner, I can definitely pull off the shade. But my first initial impressions, I actually do not really like how the lip kit looked on myself. The other liquid lipsticks, Clap Back and Better Not Pout, absolutely love them. They were amazing. And I absolutely cannot wait to rock them for the future season. So I hope you guys, as always, did enjoy that video. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Turn on your post notifications. Give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.